Hello everybody, welcome. I have received what was missing to finish building my silent NAS and these are two mini SAS cables, uh, they are internal, so one mini SAS plug to four SAS ports is a fourth breakout, breakout cable and that's what I need to use on the IBM uh, SAS card. As you can see the cable looks very nice and each port is labeled so it's gonna be easy to have the base you know, properly numbered once I have everything set up. Comes covered, they are new, quite slim and they actually fit the the finishing style of my power supply cables. Well, even though I'm actually keeping the power supply now in a very ugly position, I may replace this power supply later on or find a way to mount it in a better way. So let's now connect the first bay. And now the second port. Everything is connected, it's time now to test. So the idea now is that I'm going to remove all the trays, put a hard drive in one of them and then just test every single one of them by putting a hard drive and running FDisk, see if the hard drive is detected and then just test all of them this way. So all bays work and I'm just waiting for my hard drives to arrive. They should have arrived one hour ago but they are still not here. And once they are here, I will migrate from the from my micro server to the new server, making a new installation, restoring from backup, and then uh, creating a new volume with new encryption features and RAID Z2. And once this is all done. I will just copy the files over, burn in the disks, oh, actually burn the disks in first, then copy the files over, and once this is all done, the old server is going to go for sale, and I'll be with my new setup. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.